Hello people and welcome to a very different video for this channel, but I couldn't hold myself from making this video because it's that kind of advice or trick that you really want to sh share with people and help anybody who's looking for this kind of advice or trick. So again, couldn't help myself from making this, this video on this channel. So today I will be sharing with you a trick on how to clean your plushies. Our victim today shall be this REM plushie that I have. Boop. First, some general knowledge on cleaning plushies. The most frequent question that people make is, can I clean my plushies using a washing machine as you use for your clothes? The answer to that is yes and no. Because plushies are made with all kinds of materials, some should not be put into a washing machine but most should be okay. This one here I have cleaned many, many times using my uh, washing machine. And it hasn't gotten damaged in the slightest. So if you're mostly certain that your plushie can go when it's is washing machine safe, then make sure to use a low temperature program. Mine has a daily express program, as it calls it, uh, that you that is around 30 degrees Celsius. You can convert that to Fahrenheit if needed. Um, but yeah, it's low temperature, and that's and also make sure to set your spins or RPM to the lowest possible. Mine goes around to 400 RPM, which is nice and slow. And again, it doesn't damage these uh, the plushies. So yeah, using these settings, I have had no problems cleaning many, many plushies, especially this one. But uh, you can also uh, just clean them on your own in a tub. Just again, use cold-ish water. Maybe you can use a probe or something like, you know, just some sort of thermometer to check the water temperature. And you can also use your regular detergent and other cleaning supplies. I have, again, done this with that with detergent and like other things that, that had a nice smell to the uh, to clothes. They, they mighty fine work on your plushies. Again, just use low temperature and low spins. But believe it or not, this, that isn't enough to fully clean a plushie. The main problem is the brain problem that presents itself is dust and other small dirts and even the hair that just floats around in the air or maybe if you're like like sleeping with your plushie or whatever hair can easily get caught up and washing machines don't cl don't clean that very well especially because we're using because of the settings we are using in the washing machine the plushie does get protected from damage but it doesn't get thoroughly clean additionally using the REM plushie as an example. She has these clothing pieces that, that you can see, and the washing machine just absolutely cannot clean parts under it really well, especially if the, the, these uh, clothing or extra accessories are stitched more uh, to the plushie. Like this one at least pulls back a bit, but if it's, if it's let's say, stitched right here, the washing machine is not going to be able to do anything to that. So, we shall use a neat method to clean the dust off of our plushie. And trust me, it is absolutely night and day looking at the before and after, even feeling it. So, what will you need? Just a plain shaving razor, nothing else. I, of course, suggest you use a new razor blade, don't use the one you use on or for your own personal hygiene. But yeah, it's just a plain razor, and you will be able to use this razor afterwards for other stuff. So you can use a new razor blade that you would use for your personal hygiene. But again, make sure it's new and you haven't used it before. And after you're, yeah, you're done with this, you can easily use it uh, again. You can use it afterwards for yourself. So uh, for me, um, you know, uh, you can do that because the razor doesn't get damaged, nor does it get super dirty and it stops you from using it again on something else. I usually use these 4 plus 2 packs of um, razors, they are usually pretty cheap and you know I like to separate my own personal hygiene razors to anything else that I can use this razor for other stuff, cleaning my plushies and other, other things. And it, it doesn't really matter if the razor has a lot of blades or like marketing features that they use uh, which help in personal hygiene, but here it doesn't really matter, uh, you know, similar to, I can, I can show you my own personal razor machine, it has lots of blades and other cool stuff and it glides and bullshit, uh, it doesn't really matter if you'll get the same result anyways. 
So, so, so. What you want to do is literally shave your plushie. You don't need to use much pressure, and this doesn't damage the plushie. And if it does, any sort of damage is extremely minimal, and you will not notice it. And look, just look at the dust bunnies that come out after using the razor. And that's really it. Just nicely and softly use the razor to grab the dust from the plushie, and then you can pick it off with your hands. Now, for other sort of like special pieces, like the accessories right here, like this sort of like accessory that is, or the headband up there, up here, because this is on a, on a different material and it's not really like similar to this material right here, you will be you will be damaging things. Like you can even see from here, it is pretty dirty. There's like these dust circles right here. Like it's kind of impossible to clean these. You can pick them off with your hands. Um, and you can even use this trick with the razor for these, but you most likely will end up damaging the material. It isn't crazy, like, you won't destroy it. I have, like, tried, like, I have, like, skimmed a bit with the razor on these things to take off uh, a bit of the dust, but unfortunately for these kind of things, like, either use your hands or just leave them uh, dirty because it's kind of impossible to clean these sort of, like, more rough. They're not, they're very, like, rough instead of nice and soft. Uh, now, to those who save regularly, please do not, and I repeat, do not wash the razor, like, in between, like, the shaves, right? Like you, you would normally do. You don't need to... You can whack it a bit on, like, the your sink or something to throw some of the dust off, but the dust doesn't impact the performance of the razor here like it would do with, like, normal shaving with your hair. And of course, you just don't want to put water on the plushie and it will just you destroy it because of the water. It, it won't be nice with the water. Plus, actually, you won't be able to pick off the dust because dust and water, like, don't go well together, especially when cleaning. So again, do not wash the razor at all. Just clean everything off, then wash it, okay? And also, please, be very careful when handling razors. I accidentally cut my finger, look at, uh, well, you can, yeah, you can barely look at it, I accidentally cut off my finger uh, very slightly, and I shave twice per week, I have a lot of experience with razors for uh, three, four years, but it's, a razor is a razor, please be careful when using one. And as you can see from these images, it does wonders in cleaning it, and especially with this plushie, it also makes it feel very, uh, it makes it feel really soft and nice again. Uh, so, you know, it's just really nice to hug it. Really, really soft, soft. And that's it. It's very simple, but super effective. And again, very safe for the plushie. And you will see as you are cleaning the plushie how much the color changes. Because you might have gotten used to seeing the plushie in a bit of a slightly off color because of the dust. You're gonna start cleaning it and you'll be like, oh my goodness, it's super clean again. Oh my god, the color is changing. Um, if you want to avert your eyes, um, because here comes a photo of all of the dust that I cleaned off uh, from the splushy. It's insane how much there is. And I washed this splushy in the washing machine not a month ago, which is perfectly fine for a splushy. You don't wash these like every week or two weeks. A month or two can easily pass before you clean these off uh, in a washing machine. But again, not even a month passed. And look at all of the dust. The washing machine just wasn't able to clean the dust that well. So then, uh, if you want any help or have any questions, then throw them down in the comments. I'll try and help as much as I can because I don't own an empire of plushies, so I won't be able to answer questions about every kind of material and plushie. So, you know, I, I hope again that I can help as much as I can. So, hope this helped you and... Go shave some plushies and see the difference for yourself. Like the video and subscribe to help the channel out. I also stream daily on Twitch and I have a Twitter account. So if you want to follow those, go have some, come, come hang out in the streams on Twitch. We have lots of fun. And on Twitter, I upload all kinds of stuff, random stuff. So again, follow those if you want. Hope to see you in another video. Bye-bye.